and I've just dropped eyeshadow on my nice cream jersey. Of course. Hi, Laura here. Today I am doing a collab with what we are calling the... What are we calling it? We are doing a collab for Halloween with the Skeleton Crew and it's a multi-channel collab and we're doing a twisted bingo and we're doing six shades and we have to do them in the order that we draw them. So um, this should be interesting because I have a vague idea in mind of what I want to do but because I don't know what colours I'm getting, <laughs> I don't really know how it's going to work out. So um, we can use any palette we want and I am using my Rebel palette which I've depotted. There is one colour missing, can I ignore the white there? There's one colour missing and it's just a matte black so I'm just going to get the matte black out of my Bold Obsessions Milani palette because I didn't keep the black because I didn't need a million blacks. So that is the colour scheme that we are working on. So as far as I know the people in this collab are going to be Amy in Chrysalis and Anya Stamper and me and Nona from My Sacred Life 1977 and Cat Blue and Angie from 4F Beauty. So if anyone else joins in, I'm sorry if I missed you out. <laughs> I had thought I had already taped this video and edited it and was all ready to upload and then I went back and read the Instagram stuff and realised that it was supposed to be a palette bingo and we're supposed to be doing that. Shades in order, which I did not do last time, so I'm doing it again. <laughs> and that's why I have got a little bit of makeup already on, because I'd already done my looks for the day. <laughs> so I've taken it off, but it's, I've got a little bit of staining because I didn't take it off as well as I normally would. Okay, so I've numbered my palette 1, 2, 12, and 12 is the matte black, and I've put them in the order they're supposed to be in, in the actual palette. So... Let's get started. See what colour I get first. Okay, we've got number six first. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. So a light silver is my first colour, so that's what I have to put on first. Okie dokie. It's too bad it was the lightest colour first. Oh, I think my eye primer on for a moment. Put my eye primer on. Just putting my Milani eye primer. primer. And I'm going to go in with that silver. And on this eye, I'm going to put it all over my head. And yes, I'm going to do two different things. Because <laughs> I like to make my life complicated and difficult. Don't you? <laughs> I think I'm... You're going to get a flat brush. Do a bit of packing. I actually quite like the silver. Silver's not a hugely neat colour, but I, I don't mind the silver. Hopefully, when you see what I have planned, this will make sense. <laughs> if I can do what I have planned. And then this one, I'm going to put in the middle. And I don't have a silver eyeliner, but I have a white. So I'm going to go with white on my waterline here and then I'm going to go in with the silver over the white and then I want to spray my brush I feel like I've got silver eyeshadow in my eye I'm just doing that because I'm not using the right brush so that's what we're working with and now I need, I think, just make sure have I got everything where I want it. I think I might go in with a little brush and just put some silver here and some silver here. Okay, next colour. Will it be? Okay, next colour will 
big. Can you see that? Probably not. Oh, I can't read it. Eleven. <laughs> Eleven is the shimmery black, which is called Revolution. What was the silver called? I forgot to tell you that that one was called Boss out of the purple palette, and this one is called Revolution. Where do I want a shimmery black? Now I feel like I need to do my one that I was going to do so I can go over it with that shimmery black. <laughs> that, that, that wasn't the order I wanted to do that in, but that's what we're working with. So what I'm going to try and do is I'm trying to do a wing here of um, a bat wing. <laughs> that's what I'm trying to do. So I think I'll want to talk while I'm doing this. And I might just tip this down a bit so I'm not out of frame. <laughs> I'll probably bend down when I'm doing it. And I might do the same with another one. Anyway. <laughs> okay. So, how is this going to fits in on the side with my wrinkles really well. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go in with the black and go over that. So this is the shimmery black. Actually, they worked out quite well because I think I wanted to go over the line with some shadow. I should have done the silver as my highlighter, but I didn't think of that till now. It's too late now. I've already started the other colour. Just going to put a bit of black away. And on this side, I'm just going to do a normal liner. Okay, my third colour. Now I need my third colour. And I'm number one. Oh no. <laughs> number one is a bit dirty. Hang on, let me just clean it up. <laughs> it's got some black in it. It is a, it's called, what's it called? I can't read my writing. Apparently. <laughs> I don't know. As I said, I can't read my writing <laughs> in the back of it. So, um, it's one of those duo creamy ones that it looks creamy white and it's got a pink shift. How is this going to fit in with my look? I don't know. Okay. So, I'll put that right in the middle if I can. And I can't see it at all. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's go into my liner. And maybe I'll put some of that here. And I'm going to do some of that as my highlighter. Since so we're just doing a fun Halloween look here. Better if I'm extra glowy. And I'm going to put some of this in a weird case. If I don't get the colours that I need for the rest of this, this is just going to make no sense. <laughs> but that's okay. 
I'll just make a note in it. Is it where I want everything? So that was number three, now I'm up to number four. So. We already had six things in the past, but we got. So let's try that again. Ten. Which is number ten? Now let's have a look. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So this dark maroony colour, which is called sexy. Where do I want to put this? Okay, I'm going to get another liner. I'm going to get liner this time. And I want to go. Underneath the side, just clean the black off that brush. And then I'm going to go into the dark watering color. And then I want a bit of a fluffy brush. I want to flake that out a bit. And put some of that in here just for last. <laughs> and I want to put some of that here. And Yeah, I think. <laughs> Do I know what I'm doing? Not really. Oh, I know what I'm going to do with this. I'm going to also use this as my contour. How many colours was that? I've forgotten already. So I had one, two, three, four, five. Is that right? One, two, three, one, two, three, four. Four? Was it four? They have silver, pink, shiny black, and the maroni colour. Yeah, four. So I'm up to number five. I've only got two to go. I feel like I haven't really finished what I'm doing. I don't know that I like this number generator. You can't see numbers going round and round. That was number came up with number eight. It just immediately changes to it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, yes. I swear it wasn't rigged. I wanted Rebel. So this is Rebel from the Rebel palette. And I want to put that a little bit of this under here. And I want to put this under here. Lost my heart, right? But oh well. It happened. <laughs> I knew we need to do crazy stuff like this. <laughs> I chose my palette well for the idea I was having. Okay, that's alright. You might think this eye is looking crazy. Hopefully, it'll make sense afterwards. Now, what's my last colour going to be? Number six. I'm getting scared. Okay. Five. So, one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Not exactly the colour I was wanting. Okay. What am I going to do with this colour? Put this under here. What's this colour called? Modern, this one is called. If you're wondering why I can't read it, it's because it's all wearing off. <laughs> Can you read that? Oh, darn. <laughs> I should have used Rebel as my brush, and I didn't. 
and I've already used the green. Will be too long if I don't? Because I haven't done it wrong on my eyes. Okay, see me. <laughs> I'm going to anyway. <laughs> I got used to just using a colour and not being able to go back to it. Now, normally at this stage, I would go back and just make sure the highlighted bits were highlighted, but I can't do that if we're doing them in order, and only in order. I'm not going back to any colors. And then, I'm going to get some stickers. I'm going to get some bits. And I'm going to put some bits on my face because I'm just weird. Actually, they might be too big. Let me smile a bit. This one's too big. <laughs> I'm gonna be smaller ones. I have to draw some. Oh, Baba. <laughs> I was I was hoping I'd just get away with it, but I think I'm gonna have to draw some because they're too big. they won't end up looking like seagulls. There's a distinct possibility. <laughs> it's really hard to draw on wrinkles. Hang on, let me concentrate. And um, so I don't get to do Halloween looks much. I never do that. did them as a child. We just it just wasn't around at all when I was a child. So um, I, I'm getting to play dress up because of YouTube. <laughs> and so, so it's part of um, a group that we have going and we come up with collabs every now and then and it started off with, um, it actually just started off with three of us. I mean, and we did the mermaid look with Kaylee and Nat. Well, there was four of us. I forgot to count me. There was Kaylee... Wesley and Nat from Little Miss Nat and Kitty Dirty Havoc. And then we um, got Kat to come and join in. And then it's just grown from there. So the last one we did was the jewel inspired look. And so a group of us did that. And um, this time we are doing a Halloween kind of look. And okay. I think I need a purple lipstick for this. How can I not need a purple lipstick for this? I will link everyone down below so you can go and watch them. But they're all the people in this group are people that I've been watching and um, connecting with for a while, and they're all well worth watching. And chances are, if you follow me, you probably follow them as well because you would have seen us collabing together <laughs> anyway. So they're they're all really well worth watching and really supportive, and they're all small channels. So um, go and check them out, please. I was in frame because I just realized my camera had moved. <laughs> so this is my final look for my Skeleton Crew Twisted Bingo look for Halloween. So I just did a fun look today. Would you wear this for Halloween? Would it pass for a Halloween look? Is it too boring? <laughs> So please go and check out everyone else's videos and I'm sure you'll get a whole range of skills and different ideas from um, way out costumes to very simple looks and um, it should be lots of fun. So thanks for watching everyone and I'll see you later. Bye.